most of the programs used in Windows are associated with particular file types and protocols. For example, Windows plain text files .txt are commonly associated with Microsoft Notepad. Some of these associations are generally established when Windows is installed or upgraded from earlier version. To see the default apps used to open different file types, go to Settings, Click on Apps, click on Default Apps, scroll down and click on Choose Default Apps by File Type. You can see the default apps associated with different file types. You can scroll down to see for .txt file type, the default app is Notepad. If you want to change the default app, click on Notepad. Windows gives other apps which can open the .txt file type. You can see Word and WordPad. You can select any one you want. If you want to associate another app from Microsoft Store, you can click on Look for an app in Microsoft Store. For some of the file types, you can see Choose Default, which means currently there is no installed app or protocol on your computer to open this file type. You can check in Microsoft Store to find an app and install. If you want to find the different file types an app can open, go back to Default Apps page, scroll down and click on Set Defaults by App. Windows displays list of apps, for example, scroll down and click on Notepad app. Click on Manage. Windows displays the different file types Notepad is default app to open them. From here also you can change the default app for the file type by clicking on it. For example for .txt click on Notepad icon. Windows allows you to change the default app to WordPad or Word for .txt file type. Even though there is a default app for a specific file type, you can open a specific file with a different app too. If you have a .txt file, right click on the file, Then select Open With. Windows gives a list of apps that can open the file and you can select the app you want to open with. Select WordPad. You can see the .txt file is opened with WordPad, but the default app still remains as Notepad for .txt files. If you like this video, please subscribe to our channel.